So um, I'm going to read a poem from Fire Songs. Uh, it's called Boland Beth. And it was commissioned for a book called The Sparrowhawk's Lament by David Cobham. And it's about a hen harrier. Um, and it's an unfortunately unpleasant true story. Um, the hen harrier is on the verge of extinction in this country because it is relentlessly um, uh, persecuted by gamekeepers who are managing grouse moors because of course the hen harrier takes grouse. And Boland Beth was a hen harrier um, uh, and uh, on Boland Forest uh, all that was part of her patch, as it were, was Boland Forest. And she was shot illegally by a gamekeeper before she could breed. So the hen harry is in effect extinct, virtually extinct as a breeding bird in this country. <clears throat> it's interesting to note that they're like sparrows in France where people don't do this kind of thing. Uh, they are, of course, a protected species. <clears throat> anyway, Boland Beth. that she made shapes in air, that she saw the world as pattern and light, moorland to bare mountain, drawn by instinct, that she'd arrive at the corner of your eye, the ghost of herself going silent into the wind, that the music of her slipstream was a whisper drone tag to wingtips, that weather was a kind of rapture, that her only dream was of flight forgotten moment by moment as she dreamed it, that her low drift over heather quartering home ground might bring anyone to tears, that she would open her prey in all innocence, there being nothing of anger or sorrow in it, that her beauty was prefigured, that her sky dance went for nothing, hanging fire in plain air, that her name is meaningless, your mouth empty of it, mind empty of it, that the gunshot was another sound amid bird call, a judder if you had seen it, her line of flight broken, that she went miles before she bled out. <laughs>